So I just wanted to do a quick update on the computer I was working on. The laptop that I'm turning into a desktop. Um, so as you can tell, it looks completely different now from the last video. I didn't like the way it looked. It was way too wide and way too tall. So it wasn't very compact. So I searched it up. Uh, this is probably my third or fourth um, version here. And I just wanted to go through and show you guys what I did. So as you can tell, there's two pieces of uh, plexiglass and a wider piece that holds actually all the support. Um, just a couple brackets in the bottom. Uh, this is the new thing I made for the power supply. It's a little aluminum bracket. I notched it in there so that it has uh, stability and some strength. Still all the blue tape for the Wi-Fi. Uh, but now there's actually they're drilled right around here. And it goes through, uh, the cables go through. And then you can tell there's a Wi-Fi card right in there. So, yeah. Um, the hard drive's not attached right now. I actually ordered an extension cable for this. Uh, and it's going to wrap around the back. And it's going to be sitting uh, right around here. So I'm going to sit it here. I'm going to make another little bracket for the hard drive out of the same stuff. I bought a four foot section from Home Depot. And I'm going to just make a little bracket for it here. Have it sit there. But yeah, um, so far it looks really good. I still haven't gotten the power supply so I can't power it up yet. But uh, it should be, still be working. All the, all the ports are still open on, on this side. Um, this is just a piece of MDF that uh, was like a frame, I believe. Um, and then this is just a cover, this outside piece. Just some thinner uh, plexiglass. And then these are just some stuff I printed online and uh, laminated onto this. So you can still see, you know, the fan's going to be spinning. The LED lights for everything are going to be up, up against the side here. So you should still be able to see them pretty well. Uh, the only thing that's not going to work now is the card reader because it's down here so there's no physical way to get down there um, but it's okay it's not a big deal I rarely ever use it anyway I also have a Wi-Fi switch that's uh, right here you can tell so if I need to I can turn the Wi-Fi on or off so that's working um, and yeah you know I can still access everything I just gotta remove these five screws I also got rid of most of the double sided tape and I ended up using um, some one inch stands, um, computer standoffs. These go about halfway in through this thicker piece right here, just so that the screws could reach it. Um, and then this is just sitting completely there, just you know, just sitting on top of it. But, um, but yeah, I, I think it looks better. Uh, if you guys have any questions, just leave a comment and I'll go through and try to answer as many as I can. So, the, oh, yeah, these are still held down by double-sided tape, uh, but they're pretty sturdy. This one's not that sturdy, um, but it's okay. I'll make make that the mouse one, but the whole power button is still working, um, and yeah, the fan should look pretty good when it's spinning. The heat sink um, should do its job pretty well. It's pretty far away from anything, so I shouldn't have a heat issue. And I can't wait to see it run. I'll post a video of it once I get the power supply. I have it turned on. And, uh, yeah, see how it works. Thanks, guys.